is an Eyewitness News webcast. Hi, I'm Kelly Byrne. Here's your Eyewitness News webcast on this Thursday, January 10th. For a check of the forecast, let's send it over to meteorologist Stefano DiPietro. Good morning, Kelly. A very cold start today. It's going to stay cold this afternoon. Temperatures, which are going to just stay really in the 20s the entire afternoon, puts us back below average for this time of year. And this is without factoring in the wind, which will be gusting over 30 miles per hour at times, sustained. 10, 15, 20, even 25 miles per hour. So, not a lot of relief as far as the wind is concerned, and we're not going to really see any as we continue into tonight or tomorrow. 28 for the high today in the eyewitness weather forecast. Very windy and it's colder with some scattered snow showers and flurries, those coming off of the lake. So, not everybody gets to see one. Tonight, we're down to 12 for the overnight low. The wind stays gusty, so, some single digit wind chills in the cards for tomorrow. 26 in the afternoon and windy with clouds and sun. And then another storm system is here for the weekend. That's going to bring us some snow showers Saturday. And Sunday, Kelly. Stefano, thank you for the update there. A man is in custody this morning after an hours long standoff in Schuylkill County. State police were called to the Lake Winona gated community after a man allegedly pulled a gun on a woman. First responders could be seen leaving the gated community around 9 o'clock last night. State police say 55 year old Terry Short refused to leave a home inside the development. Troopers say it all started when Short approached the victim, a 63 year old woman. He allegedly took some of the victim's belongings and pulled a pistol on her in the driveway. Then police say he forced her back inside the home. State police were able to take him into custody peacefully hours later. Short is expected to face a slew of charges. A judge ruled there is not or there is enough evidence to send a former Luzerne County police officer to trial. Mark Eicher is charged after allegedly telling three women he would drop their citations in return for sexual favors. The women told police the incident happened during traffic stops in Ashley. Iker remains locked up without bail. Those are today's top headlines. Have a great Thursday.